All right. Tuesday, July 29, 2014. Tuesday, July 29, 2014. Right at 5.40 p.m. right now, I started working, walking at 4. I did not wake up early this morning like I did yesterday. Because uh, I worked last night over time from 8 to 11. And I just woke up to start working at 6 this morning. So I started working, uh, walking today. So it's an hour and 40 minutes right now. By the time I get to ride it, it should be... Uh, I guess six, it will be two hours of walking. I'll take my measurements there. And uh, you can see it's a, a longer route today. Uh, I wanted to do, because since I didn't walk this morning, I wanted to do a little longer this time. But that's where I'm fine right now. I'm walking towards right eight right now. Uh, um, the next thing you're gonna see are gonna be the measurements for today. Now remember, yesterday has gone up to 208. But I drank to drink a lot of water. I drank some water today, but not as much as yesterday. And I ate some grapes, and I had three figs on my on my walk today. So I'm curious to see, you know, how is it gonna look in there. But next thing you'll see is gonna be the measurements for the blood pressure, pulse, and the weight, and the BMI. All right. Let's check your weight and body mass index. Sit in the middle of the seat. Place both feet on the bar below. Great job! Here's your Higgy score. Want to track your Higgy score and stats? Okay. <clears throat> All right. <clears throat> Nine day of the 80 day, the still water fast is the ninth. Day, day number nine, and uh, as you can remember, yesterday had gone up to 208. As I told you, remember, it's a Saturday was a day in which I didn't have anything, and then on Sunday I began to drink a lot. Even Saturday evening, late evening, and I drank a lot of water. I got to make up for the Saturday, but that's what happened. A lot of liquid went in there again, and so it went down up to 208 yesterday. Uh, that's as you should see, and uh, but today is down to 206. Okay, now remember the the blood pressure was 99 over 63. That was normal. The pulse was normal, 94, and the weight 206, and then uh, 32.33 in the BMI, body mass index. Okay, so that's going down again, and today I. Uh, since last night I did a overtime from 8 to 11. This morning I did not wake up to go walking, but I, uh, I was kind of tired, so I slept. Uh, that hour that I was planning to walk, I slept there and I woke up enough to start working from 6 to 2.30. That's why I worked today in my schedule. And after that I was working on a computer until the close to 4, and then I went walking. I walked a couple of hours, and then I did the measurements over there at the right aid, as you can see. And then I walk about, from there I walk home about 35 minutes. So a total of about 2 hours and 35 minutes for I walk today. Now tomorrow I'm working early in the morning, from 3 a.m. A little more time starting early, from 3 a.m. to 6, and then my regular schedule from 6 to 2.30. And that's going to be for Wednesday and also Thursday, I believe. So thank God, our time is coming back again. So I want to be walking in the afternoon, just like I did today. Uh, couple uh, of, maybe maybe I'll try three hours tomorrow, and three hours on uh, Thursday as well, you know, and go a little bit higher on Friday, maybe three and a half hours, but that's the plan. But slowly but surely, you know, things are happening the right way, so as it is, and nine days, 
Now I've been drinking distilled water for a long time, you know. So it's, it's prior to this fast, I had done it almost in all my fasts. And distilled water is just another word for pure water. You know, the th the fact that we use the word distilled means is that uh, the water is not still. It has a negative charge to it. Uh, pure water has a negative charge to it, and it's not attached to anything. And anything that in the body, I've been told that does not supposed to be, be there has a positive charge. So when you drink distilled water, it attaches to anything that's not supposed to be in your body and it washes it off. You know, that's the whole idea. That's why it's helpful. Now, all the other waters that you buy, mineral water and what have you, they are ready, the negative, the pure water is attached to the mineral. Okay, so and that mineral usually is not the ones that are found in plants, inorganic minerals, and they go into your system. And what distilled water does, it flushes out inorganic minerals. But if you have organic minerals, the one that come from fruits and vegetables, raw fruits and vegetables, they stay in your body and they use for your body. Your body uses it for what is needed. Okay, so those are things to remember. Uh, because a lot of people say things about the distilled water, they don't even have to try it, they just try to discourage you. But the distilled water is just pure water. You know the water that goes up in the sky to heaven and then falls down? That's distilled water, it's pure water too. There's nothing wrong with that. I have places I told you before that where you can find distilled water, urine has distilled water, pure water. Fruits have distilled water in them, pure water. So, you know, that's why it's good to intermingle this with, with fruits. You know, you notice I, it's a season of figs in my walking route, so I pick up on the figs. And there's a lot of fig trees, you know, on each tree. I have to have a couple of them that are just hanging there and I grab them, I see them in my, in my path, there's about 10 fig trees. And from one of those I get a two or three or sometimes five, you know. So that's, that's what's been my, I feel like God is feeding me with the rest of the animals in the field, you know. It's kind of blessing and it feels very relaxed to walk that way. So praise God, that's what's been happening. And today is the ninth day and uh, I'm getting ready. I was going to show you the exercises. Uh, but I might have to do it tomorrow because the uh, the area where I was going to use it, they, they put a little children pool in there and I cannot do my exercises there. So I will be doing my exercises later on before I go to sleep tonight, you know, in the living room. Uh, but uh, pet exercises are very good to do. And those are the only ones I'm doing. I remember I'm doing uh, five sets, five exercises, do uh, 13 repetitions of each, you know, a set of 13 for each. That's what we're doing this week and then increase so three more for next week, but that's the whole idea. Hopefully I'll get to show you for this week, but that's all that's happening today. And I thought I'd share that with you. So, praise God. Things seems to be working okay. And in God's grace, I'll keep you posted when things are working.